This is a First Alert Weather Special Report. Well, good afternoon, everybody. Thank you so much for spending some time with us. Another live update. It's one o'clock in New York. And in New York, we have some new advisories. There's a flash flood warning for the city. Again, all of this makes sense. I mean, there's a flash flood watch for everybody, but we're seeing some more specific warnings. This was just posted minutes ago. This is for the city, also incorporates counties to the north. And there's another warning. This is until 4 p.m. Show you the radar in just a second. Follow that line up into parts of Connecticut, and you've got one that's in effect until 4.15. Uh, again, we're back under this warning for Westchester, Putnam, New Haven, and uh, Fairfield. And then well, we also have a, uh, this one we talked about, this one we picked up about an hour ago. This is Middlesex, Somerset, and you're picking up on the pattern, aren't you? It's like lines. Well, we're seeing these lines of showers fill in with the heavy rain. So zooming in, so you look at uh, parts of Queens, definitely up through the Bronx and then into Westchester County, and the more rain will fill in. And the problem is, I mean, this is hour after hour. You may get a break, but there's still heavy rain. Boy, I gotta tell you, some of the, there lots of issues with flooding out on the island, more reports of road closures in New Jersey. And then follow this, that's gonna fill in and then you'll see issues for Suffolk over the Sound, possibly into parts of Connecticut. And then when you follow this line, that's filling in. This will likely hold together. So this will be hours before we're done with the worst of this. And you can see it's very active. It's been really difficult through parts of uh, Pennsylvania, around Philadelphia. They've had multiple warnings, really some tragic stories there. And then look at how much of Maryland is filling in. Look at that. Through the Capitol all the way down to the south. So let's again, using a computer model, we'll try to look at the next few hours. Skipping ahead to about two, it's holding this line together right there over the city. That line together as well. And that's going to continue to bring the risk of more flooding for Nassau. Suffolk, the city, up into Rockland, Westchester. Boy, and if that holds together, you know, you've got to remember Rockland and Orange had the worst of the flooding just a week ago, where they had eight inches of rain. Now we've added three, four, five, six inches of rain, and we're not done with it yet. Again, we could see, is this now seven o'clock at night, out 80, out 78, you could still see some of these wraparound showers. And then this would be a nasty way to wrap this up. Orange County, where you're dealing with still roads closed from last week. It's, it's like rocks, boulders. Boy, and there was a report out of Warren County. We've got crews west and east uh, trying to track down some of this, but there was a report of like a mudslide. This all wraps up overnight into the first part of your Monday. And then Monday, it's just hot. So you, you gotta make sure that you're ready for that. Key, key risk is still gonna be the heavy rain. There is that tornado watch, but we haven't seen any rotation or there are no warnings as far as tornadoes. It's all about the flash flood warnings. And a flash flood warning means we're already seeing the rapid rise of water. 82, rain continues, at least for the next few hours. This is the day. We do get a break Monday. Tuesday, there's another round. Wednesday, there's another break. We really need these breaks. That's what's causing all the problem. It's rain over real estate that has been saturated for days. So again, pace yourself, seven day details. There's a lot more summer weather that we're gonna be dealing with those pop-up storms Tuesday, another round Thursday into Friday. But this is a really challenging situation. Common sense has to rain because when it continues to rain, those waters can rise rapidly and uh, cause a lot of issues. If you don't know how deep it is, don't drive through it. You know, stick around, keep, keep it right here. It's the safe way to enjoy a Sunday. Just watching CBS News, New York.